Hey everyone, Harris here with iDownload Blog, and Stickies is, I believe, a totally undervalued and underused Mac program that actually has a surprising amount of convenient practical features. While this has been around since Mac updates cost money, uh, today I'm going to tell you reasons why you may want to start using it if you don't already. Starting off, it has the majority of the core features a Notes application should have. You can add a list manually or by clicking Option plus Tab and pressing Enter adds additional items. Pressing Tab allows you to indent on the list and add subcategories, which you can do as many as you want, and then Shift plus Tab returns you back a tab spot up until you get to the beginning. You can also get to list settings with a right click that allows you to modify the bullet characters and change up the settings of your list. Other standard features include spell check, turning smart links on or off, which basically just enables that link to be clickable or not. Uh, there's speak to text dictation, there's data detectors for things such as addresses and places, command F for searching through the document, and of course formatting font, colors, bold, underlined, italic, etc. You can customize this for your needs. Now one nice feature of stickies, which is also found in the notes app, is floating on top to make sure that the note never gets covered up by another application or document if you don't want it to get hidden. One exclusive feature over the notes app would be the transparency options. This can be used cosmetically or it can be used functionally in combination with the floating mode to type away on notes while this is overlaying a video or other text to maximize screen real estate which is a nifty feature and something that I can see myself using. You can also change the color of the note with the command 1 through 6 allowing you six different color options. Additionally, there's the ability to double click the status bar and shrink the note down to a few pixels tall to keep it out of the way but still available with a double click uh, to get it back out on your desktop and it looks pretty nice if you just have it chilling in the corner. There's also features such as the new import from iPhone or iPad with iOS 12 if you want to import a photo or document scanned from your phone into the note and also annotate it. And you can also insert video files into the note which is a cool feature. The one big feature missing from this would be cloud support. While you can save it to an iCloud location and retrieve it from files on another iOS device, you'll lose the ability to edit and you can't retrieve the original sticky file. So cloud support and multi-device support would be the big feature missing here. So while Stickies isn't perfect and lacks integrated organic cloud support, it's actually a pretty nice notes application for your Mac if you're looking for quick notes, especially using the overlay, transparency, and color options, and then minimizing it to hide it away makes it a really simple and quick notes application. You can always transfer the sticky note to your notes application as well if you want to. But this has been a look at stickies for Mac. Let me know if this is a program you use or would consider using now. Uh, you can leave those in the comments. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos just like this.